Well, is it spring yet? No, it's still January. So, uh, and here we have some cold weather coming back. It's been a little milder. You know, we had the blast around Christmas and then it's got mild again. It's kind of lulled us into, but really we got cold temperatures coming and have you buttoned up the house? I mean, it's not too late to button up the house. Today, I'm gonna show you a few old school things. First of all, this is kind of stupid, but this happens all the time. People have blinds, they forget to shut the windows all the way. You know, the, they, they go down like this and they leak. Make sure that you get those windows all the way shut. You'd be surprised. Then doors is another big thing. So now I said old school, this is old school. This is called weather strip tape. It's been around forever and it's got adhesive. You can actually use it outside up to 10 below zero, but it, and it comes off in the spring, not, you know, it's certainly not for everyday use. It's just for those problem areas that maybe it's just leaking and you can kind of seal it up just like that. Bottoms of the doors are huge. And so what happens is as the manufacturer, as, as that weather strip wears out on a door, it just leaks so bad. So you can do easy things. So this, this is the easiest right here. This is what are, they're called rubber drag strips. So uh, it's kind of hard to see in here, but this, this piece is rubber and this is adhesive. So you can actually stick that right to the door like that. Now, I will tell you, if there's some movement in that door, it's a little rough, you'll be much better off to put the kind on there, the rubber strip that you actually screw on and you just screw that onto the bottom and you have to kind of clip it off. But that is a huge savings and will really help out your furnace. Now the other real old school thing, and these probably came out, must have been the 70s, uh, window kits. And people forget about them. This is shrink film. You can get them, you know, one of the, the big ones is for sliding doors, old sliding doors that haven't been replaced, leak like a sieve. And what you basically do comes with this little two-sided tape. You put the two-sided tape around the perimeter. Now this isn't a good example because you wouldn't really put it around a, a door like that. But yes, that is a leftover train from Christmas out there. You peel off the double stick tape like so. And then you would just put the shrink film up like this. And it doesn't, you know, you pull it as tight as you can get it. It doesn't have to be, certainly have to be perfect like that. But now back in the day, that would look a little you know, kind of wrinkly and people go, what are, what are you doing there? But with the shrink film, so I've kind of set it up over here, get a hairdryer. This happens to be a paint stripper. So if I, if you see holes blow in the plastic, you'll know I got too close. And you'll see, I don't know if you can see it, there's a big bubble in there. And you just work your way down. And again, simple, old school, yes, but so effective. So look at this, see that up there? I hope you can't see it up there because that should just look like glass, all right? I'm just trying to do things to get you to spring. Have a good day.